Hello, Growth Vegan here, back with another episode of Grand Tactician The Civil War. It is November 27th, 1861, and the Union forces have moved pretty far south into North Carolina, and we're starting to go down south into South Carolina and into Georgia. We have one army in the very top corner of uh, Mississippi here, and, uh, and so <clears throat> we, we are making some progress. Uh, all across uh, the uh, the land, except for in Arkansas. We have two armies in Missouri that are just sitting and waiting, and they will probably go ahead and do so throughout the winter. Uh, they are waiting on some additional units, I believe. Actually, yeah, he's still waiting on a few more of his brigades to come to strength, uh, his cavalry brigade. So they're, gonna, they're probably going to wait until the, uh, the winter is over to start a spring campaign in the west here. Over further east, we are going to continue our campaign, but probably not at the speed that we are currently uh, going at. We'll probably push the Army of Washington all the way down here to Cassville, and then start setting up some supply depots there. Um, this army, uh, the Army of Lincoln, has created one supply depot here at Chattanooga, and I think I'm going to go ahead and make another one here as well while they're waiting. If I can find a spot to do it. There we go. So they are going to do that. And they have been assigned. <coughs> they just leveled up. So I can assign them a perk. Uh, they are going to. They are largely just a uh, engineering column. So I need to find a perk. That gives them a good uh, engineering type thing here. Alright here we go. Engineers and mechanics. Construction speed plus 25%. Level up by constructing forts, depots, and telegraph stations. That's exactly what we want here. I'm going to go ahead and give that to him. And he's going to do that. This army of the Potomac is on their way down to Cassville as well. They're going to go uh, towards um, Atlanta. Probably in the spring, but maybe sooner. But I want to maybe make a few more supply depots along the way. So I may just have him come here instead. Oops, no, I don't want to do that. No, 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 cancel that. I may just want to tell him his uh, to halt his current orders. He will do so in one hour. Okay. This army of New York is on its way down here, and he's not going to be in supply, is he? Because he's uh, uh, you no, know, he's not. So he probably should have built a supply depot here at Asheville. Honestly. We'll go ahead and build one here, and then we may come back up and build some as well. Or we may bring the Army of Lincoln over and build some uh, during the winter. But we definitely need to build some supply depots along the way there. He's going he's gonna to get out of supply. We have the Army of the Ohio at Charlotte, North Carolina. And they are currently working uh, on just uh, regaining their readiness. I'm going to go ahead and have him build another supply depot here as well and level up all these depots that are around so i'm gonna go ahead and just go around level up all the depots that i can and that should help with the supply situation all around all across the board here and then i have an army over here uh besieging this fort 38th army is besieging the battle of fort macon and uh there's 65 men there uh so far <laughs> We're getting the worst of it. We got 88 casualties. Uh, I'm not sure how to. Maybe I'm doing this wrong. I don't know. I got 45 guns pounding this fort. He's got, uh, I guess, 13 guns in there, and uh, they're holding off. Uh, actually, how many guns do they have here? Hold on. Can I get this off here? There we go. It's got, uh, yeah, fort firepower is 13. Hmm. I mean, it shows we're winning, but maybe we just have to keep at it until, I don't know. I'm not sure. I've never done a siege before, so it's my first one. Over here, likewise, the Army of uh, Northeastern Virginia. Likewise, are laying siege to this Fort Caswell. So I got both of my big armies tied up doing sieges here, which is probably not a good idea. I don't know what the South Carolina uh, army is going to do, but I'm going to go ahead and tell him to stop that. Yeah, we're going to we're going to stop that siege. 
And it might give us a hit of some sort, but... Oh! Well, who this? Hold on. The Army of the Potomac is getting in contact with the Art Department of Pennsylvania. Alright, so over here in uh, South Carolina here, the Army of the Potomac is marching north and have come in contact with the Department of Pennsylvania, and I guess that means we're going to have to do a little fight. 87-82 versus 79-76. 19 guns versus 9 guns, which is not the best situation. Although we do have some cav, maybe we can maneuver around and get those guns. We'll see. We go ahead and play the battle. Battle of Winsboro, South Carolina. South of where I live in real life. All right, so pretty equal forces, all things considered. We are on the map of Centerville. Now, the uh, I have the new update in which the 2D sprites are replaced by the 3D models. It's the beta version of the uh, upgrade so there may be some bugs but uh, I was eager to check it out so I went ahead and downloaded it and let's see where we can hold here they could they could ingress in two different places no they only have one point of ingress right here so looks like our best bet is to hold this road and see if we could push down to that river before they get there they, they'll probably get there first but we'll race for it we'll race for it so let's get Patterson and the Department of Pennsylvania, and we will post up on this area here. This uh, artillery position, uh, I'm going to go ahead and have them limber up so they can move faster. Yep, okay. And I'm going to have the cavalry get them detached, okay. And I'm going to have my two infantry divisions to go long range. Just like so. There we go. All right, I, th I think they were ready. We're going to do that, and then he's going to send those orders. And get the artillery moving down there. Cav, move on down to the river. Hey, oh, there you go. Post haste. You guys move on down as well. Okay, and then you guys, I want you to move down here all the way down to the river. Okay, now we wait. Wait for our units to come into contact. Let's take a look at the sprite, the uh, 3D models. Look at that. That does look a lot better. Wow, yeah. I'm impressed. Looks a lot better than the 2D sprites. A lot less flat. They're obviously still working on them, but uh, this is a huge improvement just by itself. Oh, nice. I can't wait to see them in battle. Here's my horsies. Oh, yeah. Good. Good stuff. There's the cannon. Awesome. <laughs> okay. Very good. Let's come on down to the battle town. Of course, we got a bit of a traffic jam here. My fault. I should have let the cavalry pass by first. Cavalry's in the back, of course. Why wouldn't they be? Let's put the fastest unit in the back. That's That makes perfect sense. Now let's, okay, let's grab this uh, cavalry division here. Where's the division commander for the cavalry? Uh, Buford. Buford, I want you to tell your guys not to use roads. Okay, just 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 get down there. Get down there as quick as you can. Okay, so this uh, infantry division has posted up. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and tell them to I'll slow down a little bit. Get these orders. I'm gonna tell this cannon to come on down. It looks like we made it here before them. That's good. I'm gonna go ahead and post the cannon up down here, and we'll tell the infantry division to form up over here. There's like that. There we go. <clears throat> that way if uh, he tries to get all sneaky, we can uh, we can block him. I think we'll be all right. He's got to be down here somewhere. What do they want to throw out my skirmishers? I'll increase my vision and my maneuverability. So come on down here. go 
Awesome. There they are over there. Okay. Well, we can flank them. It's fine. We got. We do have this unit coming over there. So I'm going to have him rush on over. Go. You do that. You do you, bro. Okay. Yeah, so he decided to take this uh, western crossing here. Who knows why? Doesn't matter why, just that matters that he did. So, you know what, actually? I tell you guys to halt. I tell them to halt. I'm going to bring the cavalry across the river. We're just going to try to strike them as they, as they cross from behind. Okay. Come on down here. Go ahead and put your skirmishers out now that you're in position. There we go. Awesome. Those guys are going to take that road over. That's good. For the artillery, I think I should go ahead and move it over as well. Pop that over there just like that. They're going to get across before we get over there. All right, so that means I'm going to get these guys, yeah, they're going to get across. I held the wrong crossing, that's all right. We need to make sure this division don't run into them. All right, so this guy, where's his position? Okay, we're going to have to call a halt. I want you to come up here. Call a halt. Dear man, come on, man, get that courier. Here comes the courier down here. Oh, the courier looks a lot better. Heck yeah. Okay. All right, you guys come back behind this fence row. There you go. You guys. Uh, if he tries to come down this way, we'll we'll bring that other division up. We're gonna bring both of the fence rows up there. The second division. All right, cannon fire, you're going to have to come up here. All right, he's going to be all right, I think. Look at where he's going now. Actually, I might just put him in this field and tell him to stop as well. You guys, come on down here. No, that's not. I got the wrong unit selected here. Okay, there we go. You guys come down here. Advance. You guys be in reserve. Advance. Division commander, come down here. Okay. Yeah, he's good. he's about to form up. Okay, he's still marching. He's still marching. All right. So, Cav is on the on the move still. Very good. Let's get our skirmishers out as well. Harass him a little bit. Okay. I think we're going to be in good shape. I want these guys to actually get a halt right here where they're at. Bro, you're in bugle range. Just tell them to halt. There you go. Okay. Thank you. Unlimber. Let's see if you got a shot on those guys. Can't tell what your aim range is because you're pointing in the wrong direction. There you go. Those cannons deployed. Straight out. Straight away. Oh, hey, 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 ho. This is a detachment as well. Yeah, go after this cannon. All right, our uh, skirmishers made contact here with a whole brigade, so probably not the best situation for us. Scurry's brigade. There's only 409 men, though. Wind coop. Only 186 men. So. Let's hold them off. Keep them busy. All right, while we get into position over here. 
are we doing down here? Okay, we're good. Come on up it this way. We're gonna see if I can get these cannons as they move. What are those cannons doing? Where are they going? Are we firing our cannons? Yes. Skirmishers keeping these guys engaged, keeping them busy. Williams Brigade, Williams Detachment, go up and engage this guy. Keep him busy, please. We're in the marshes down here, which is not ideal. There goes our our skirmishers. All right, they were just a delaying tactic anyway. All right, Kev, are we ready? Come get these guys. Double time it. Get them while they're marching. Might actually even be able to capture the guns. Oh crap! No, they deployed. Get them. There you go. Get them. Get on them. I know you're you're not doing too good here. So let's uh, rally them in. You're wrecking them. You're wrecking them. Good job, Taylor. Get your men going. Keep them, keep them going. They're nervous. 38%. Okay. Keep going. It's like it's going up, though, so that's good. Fire on these guys, please. What, what are you doing? Where are you guys going? Wind Coops Brigade? No. What? I did not tell them to go up there. Get out of there. Stop that. Halt right now. They are charging those guys. Come back to your fence row, please. Fall back and fire. They're charging now. Great. Oh my god. Oh my god. Quinn Coop, you imbecile. Give up the high ground just to do a freaking glory charge. All right, come down here. Hold this gap. Obviously, your your compatriots have failed you. All right, they have abandoned their guns. We're gonna go charge them. Take the prisoners best we can. Okay. Division commander, come up just a little bit. Okay. Alright, so we, we didn't capture these guns, but we did chase them off, looks like, off from one of their guns. So that's good. Alright. Cavalry's taking those guys. I want them to detach and grab those guns. Okay. What are you guys doing? Warm up right here. There you go. We did get some prisoners in flight. We've left some of them behind, but they're about to break, so I'm, I'm pulling them back. All right, go ahead and rally your men. Rally. Guys, what are you... Where are they going? They're not obeying my orders. <laughs> they didn't break. They're just unstable. Oh, my God. Okay. The AI sometimes is so infuriating. All right, so go ahead and bring them back. I mean, they're, they're, the commanders have a mind of their own, so they can, you can turn it off so that they don't, but I kind of like it like that. It's, it kind of makes it a little more interesting, I think, sometimes. All right, Taylor's detachment, <laughs> he's probably going to break because he's down here all by himself, but if I can get those guns, I can start firing on these guys from behind, which will be good. All right, can we go ahead and bring out more skirmishers? Oh crap, the skirmishers just got wrecked. Okay. Alright, bring them back in then. They're, they're just gonna get killed. Okay. Alright, this is gonna be a stand up battle then, looks like. It's not gonna be a, a walkover like I was hoping for. Come back over here. Where is my cab brigade? Yeah, they broke. They just. I don't know why they panicked. Why did they panic? 
We had it all. <sighs> Annoying. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. As long as the t detachment don't break as well. They're, they're nervous, but uh, they don't have any detractors, I don't think. Rally, rally value plus 10% nearby commanders. Overall ch change per hour. Okay, I think we're good. Alright, so he's sending up a, uh, a brigade here after us. Scurry's brigade. How many guys are in there? It's like a couple dozen. It's be less. Alright. 275 men, 155 casualties. Wow. Nagley, what are you doing here, bro? What are you doing? You're just not quite in range. him off. Scared him off. Okay, good. What are you doing? Can you please rally your men? Goodness sake. You guys are the worst. One of the biggest brigades and they, they're all just running off. Okay. Looks like he's got a range uh, advantage on us. He's, uh, he's already firing and he's outside of our range, so that's not good. However, he is disorganized, so we can go ahead and push forward. Push forward. Advance, men, advance. There we go. This division is going to move up. There we go. Ready to fire. They're in the marsh. So they should have some negative modifiers. Another brigade coming up to support. Let's go ahead and move this brigade up, Negley's brigade, to support as well. Look at this division commander down there. Okay. I don't know if this cannon is even going to come into play. It's taking them so long to, to get moving. Doing good here. Yeah. Williams and Thomas. Keep going. Keep going. We got we got our cannon trained on them. That's good. All right, Taylor, moving up. Where's your buddies? The horses. They're down here. Still broken. Sure could use some cavalry right now to fire across this river. Sure could. I want you boys double time it. Let the brothers out. Got to still firing. Williams is in contact, you think? We're pushing them back. They're falling back. Push forward. Push forward. Negley, you push forward towards him. Alright, we got it. We got him. Keep pushing, guys. Keep pushing. They're retreating, so we're going to push forward. Keep pushing forward. Got 48 minutes to do as much damage as we can. Unfortunately, we do not have our calves, so. Alright, so <laughs> these guns finally get some shots in here at the end. Okay. Keep firing. Keep firing. Good job. Good job, man. Oh, man, this looks great. I'm loving the new 3D. I need to look and see. There's a way you can zoom in further on the map. I need to look and see what that is. 
if I could be able to zoom in just a little bit more. I wish there was a way to hide the HUD too. Take screenshots. I could use some great screenshots from the game. Push, push. There you go. Those guys are marching away, so go ahead and jump on them if you can. Tell these guys to come down and help out. Get these guys pushed up against the creek here. They're not feeling too hot. Okay. Have we just taken some pot shots at them? Good. Anybody still in range of you? Yeah, he's still got all of these guys in range and these cannons. That's good. Firing. Guys are exhausted. Okay. This is finally stopped. Like rest. These guys are well rested. You know they've been fighting this the entire time. Okay. Keep, up, keep pushing up. Keep pushing up. They're trying to cross the river. It's a perfect time to take them out. In fact, I'm not going to even charge them. I'm hesitant though. Those guys broke. I can probably just go ahead and charge in. Go ahead and charge in. Charge men. Yeah, we're taking shots at these guys. There you go. Awesome. Try to cross the river, see if we can catch them before they cross. We might be able to do a big capture here. Shoot them. They made they got across. Dang. Now we're gonna have to cross. Now oh, they broke. They broke. Good. Get them. Get them. Come on, you. You're mine. Get into my hands. Come on, Thomas and Brigade. Get in there. Grab them. We're still chasing off these guys. Emperor's Brigade. Nice. These guys are getting captured, presumably. They're routing. Nice. Cap them. Cap them. Oh, yeah. We got those guys. We may not be able to catch these guys. These guys are probably going to get too tired. Cap them. Is my cavalry back yet yeah, in action? Nope, still broken. It's too bad. These guys are winded. They may not be able to catch them. Come on, McGowan's brigade. Get all of them. I want the entire brigade smashed. All these guys stand in the ground suddenly. Wow. That was a surprise. Because they figured they had no choice. Keep on them. There's confusion and delay over here. You might be able to catch them. Come on. I'm very tired, I know. You've been charging since that river several hundred yards back. After a long day of combat, tap them. Tap them. Arrest those men. Oh my god. They panicked. They saw, oh, there's some guys routing coming. Yeah. Didn't even see. <laughs> they ran past them. Nice. Oh, I, I failed to get this going. Okay. That's unfortunate. Now nah, I'm not going to capture them because these guys are already engaged. Yeah, it's, it's over anyway. Alright. Not bad. Not bad. We got uh, the Department of Pennsylvania lost 892 men. Cavalry only lost 17. 
lost none of my artillery. He lost half of his artillery and almost half of his infantry. All right, victory at Winsboro. Great. Okay. However, I'm not going to give a chase. I'm just going to stand here. We're going to continue to make supply depots because we, we need them. In fact, I think I was, I believe I was upgrading all my depots whenever that battle came up. All right, so this army down here, uh, I'm marching away from the fort because South Carolina um, militia is on their way on the move. I guess I can't give orders to these guys till they get back to their uh, location or something because I, cause I called a retreat. Oh, it's because they're still engaged, technically. Okay. I just don't want South Carolina militia to come and attack us while we're attacking that fort. Alright, so we're building this uh, supply depot while we're <laughs> attacking that town as well. So that's good. Let's see, uh, New Bern. Are they giving us any supplies from New Bern? Uh, no. Uh, well, we're getting uh, some supply from a depot and uh, local supply. So, yeah, it's uh, slow going on those guys. And it's winter, so it's probably best that we go ahead and get out of here. Although the Trent affair is resolved. I wanted to, uh, I didn't want him to retreat all the way back up here to Fayetteville. But, you know, I wanted him to stay here in Wilmington. Did you come back to Wilmington? slow winter movement that's alright probably needed to come over here and get everything all upgraded anyway slow down our advance a little because uh, we'll not run our supply which I'm very good at doing oh look uh, the Department of Pennsylvania has leveled up let's go ahead and grab them I like to get the uh, flying column uh, to get additional movement speed and supply that's good Army of New York they are on the move still. All right. Doing all these supply depot upgrades. Two year contracts. Okay, hold on. Do we have a policy now that it's ready to be uh, enacted here? Let's see what we got. I'm thinking we might want to do industrialization, which gives us. Uh, Heavy industry more profitable, increasing supply of goods, and encouraging further expansion. Or, I already did emancipation. Okay, good. I could get the United States Colored Troops to get uh, black soldiers against Southerners. Alright, that might be good. How many brigades do we get initially when we do that? Uh, three brigades. Huh? That wouldn't be bad at all. Uh... The Militia Act, 36 month contracts, that wouldn't be bad either, but I think I'm going to go with uh, industrialization for now, get additional supply going, because we, we uh, even though we've been doing well on our pushes, uh, we're going to really start slowing down as we outrun our supplies, so we make sure all of our supplies are in good shape. Okay, so we're going to do some resupplying around in here. Army of the Mississippi, why don't you go ahead and make some supply depots where you're at as well. Okay. Yeah, because you're already outrunning your supply. Yeah, he's, he's too far from these guys already. Okay, so I'm going to upgrade them and him. Okay. So he's going to do that. You guys, Army of Indiana. I'm going to go ahead and assign the flying column to you. You guys, not quite ready, but he'll get the engineering one. Okay. Uh, I can probably go attack the Army of Western Tennessee. I probably need to build a supply depot first, but I'm going to push in and go ahead and attack them. Because I can. Upgrade that Jackson depot. Try to get all my depots around this area upgraded if I can. Okay. Department of Ohio, get your Springfield depot up. 
go. Awesome. Let's just get all these in the line. Upgraded. Okay. Alright. Excellent. Go ahead and make another one. While you're just sitting here. Make some more depots. And then we can push south. Alright. So we've got that army of uh, northeastern Virginia here. We're going to start building some depots here as well. Got one already, but we need a second one. There we go. And then we'll uh, start moving, I guess, south and building more depots on the, along the way. All right, so there, the Western Tennessee Army is withdrawing. We are pursuing, I guess. Keep moving. Keep moving. He's trying to build supply depots as well. Yep. Should have thought of that before, buddy. Should have thought of that before. Okay, so that's going to be about it for this episode. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you did, be sure and hit that like button. Stay tuned next time as we push further into the south. We'll be moving into South Carolina. And uh, we'll be doing it on the east coast and down here in central South Carolina. Looks like the South Carolina State Militia is moving back to the capital of Columbia. So uh, hopefully the Department of Pennsylvania is uh, in a position to defend against them. Uh, how much do they have? They're a bigger army, aren't they? Yes, 19,000. So we may end up having to bring down the Army of the Ohio to assist. Uh, if that's the case, then that's what we will do. But I'm not going to worry about it just overly much because I, I feel like uh, we're going to be in a good shape and uh, not have to be pressed. I don't I don't think we're going to be pressed for, for an advantage, so I think we'll be okay. I'm going to go ahead and start building depots all around everywhere we stop build a depot. Uh oh, Hampton Division on his way up too, so uh, eight days? They're going to be here before eight days, so I probably should start sending this guy on down to uh, reinforce. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And then uh if we're going to have a big battle next episode, then so be it. But I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure and hit that like button, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.